Hi everyone, today I'm making gỏi gà bắp cải or chicken salad with cabbage. It's a very popular Vietnamese salad that you can serve as an appetizer or with some chicken congee chiao gà. Let's begin. Helen's recipes. For the chicken, you can buy chicken breast. In Vietnam, they don't sell chicken breasts separately, so I have to buy the whole chicken like this. I rub it with uh, some salt and some smack ginger to remove the strong poultry smell and then rinse the chicken inside out with tap water. I'm gonna remove the chicken thigh and drumstick for another dish and also the wings, so we're gonna use just the body parts of the chicken. Cook the chicken with a teaspoon of salt and half a peach onion for about 15 to 20 minutes until it's cooked through. For the salad, you're gonna need some Vietnamese mint rau ram, shredded carrot, some cabbage, half a yellow onion, some lime and chilies, and also some crispy fried shallots. To enhance the flavor of the chicken meat, we always add lime leaves. You can also use the coffee lime leaves that you can buy frozen at Asian store. Roll them up like a cigar and then cut into really thin threads. Also cut the onion crosswise into really thin slices. And then soak in ice cold water to reduce the strong onion smell and also to keep it really crisp. Cut the cabbage in quarters. Then cut off the stem at a 45 degree angle to create a base to keep the cabbage piece stable while we shred it into really fine strips. This is such a perfect way to shred cabbage that I've learned from a Japanese lady on YouTube and I've been loving it ever since. When the chicken is cooked through, take it out and let cool completely before we remove the skin and shred the chicken breast into strips. The chicken will taste a lot better if you shred by hand rather than slide into strips because the dressing and seasoning is gonna absorb into the fiber grains of the chicken meat. To make the salad dressing in a bowl, we're gonna mix together two tablespoons of sugar with three tablespoons of fish sauce. Also squeeze in about one to two tablespoons of lime juice, depending on how sour you want your salad to be. And then give it a good stir to help the sugar dissolve. Then add the minced garlic and chili so they will float on top. The dressing should have the balance between sweet, sour and savory. Perfect. To assemble the salad, we're going to add 1 cup of the shredded chicken and mix with about 3 tablespoons of the dressing, some cracked peppers and the lime leaf threads. Mix well before you add 1 cup of carrot, 1 cup of sliced onion and 2 cups of uh, shredded cabbage. Now add more dressing, adjusting to your taste. Give it a really good toss. Oops, I forgot to add in the lime leaves earlier, so I'm gonna add in now. Actually, you should mix it with the shredded chicken first. Mix well and set aside until you serve. Have a taste and only add about a cup to a cup and a half of the chopped Vietnamese mint as the last step. Finally, you can add the crispy fried shallots and saving some for garnish later. Now it's ready to serve, you can just transfer it to a serving plate. Top with some fried shallots, cracked peppers and some chili slices. Mmm, yum yum. By the way, thank you so much for those of you who have showed up at my book signing section at Vincom Da Nang a couple of weeks ago. It was so lovely to finally meet some of you in person and have a quick chit chat at the PNC bookstore. Hopefully I can organize more sections like this in other cities as well in the future. Also, I'm really happy to announce that the Helen's Recipe app is now available on iOS and you can download it for free on Apple Store. 
The Android version is hopefully coming soon. Let's continue to stay connected and share more delicious Vietnamese foods and recipes. Mi Autumn Festival is coming close. I can really feel that through all the delicious cakes that you have uploaded on Instagram with hashtag Highland Recipes. Thank you for sharing and watching. Bye bye.